Shannon Babb, Jason Fager, green flag in the air. The Brownstown Bullring roars to life. Here we go. Hashtag on 50 laps around this place. It'll be Fager, your race leader, down the back. Shoot 25. Jason Fager up top. Billy Moyer trying to roll right with him. Babb to the bottom in 18. Lap one to Fager. Jason Fager up top to the lead. Babb going to take a look to the inside. Billy Moyer again rolling around the top side. He'll get by Babb to the second spot. And Fager hooked the, a little bit of a rut there for a second. He got that car turned just in time. Clear sailing after the 25 of Fager. We are not even to the halfway point. This has been entertaining so far. Fager's led them all, but not without pretty heavy pressure. Moyer again reeling them back in. Here comes Billy. Oh, and Billy Moyer Jr. All four tires off the ground. Boy, he got just a little too high and clipped the right rear. He went flying in the air. Shannon Babb went racing on by. Moyer was able to catch it and correct it, and he stayed on the racetrack. He has slipped back behind Gardner. He'll go back by him if he can, but Shannon Babb now back to a solid second. Winger and Nickerson get a battle for that 10th spot right now, but it's hard to take our eyes off the battle for the lead. It's not a huge battle, oh, and we've got a couple cars together. I didn't see that start, but Logan Nickerson's around. First caution of the event on lap 21 for the 21 of Logan Nickerson. Caution lights are out. The high side hustler bringing us back to green this time by off turn four. Back to green we go. Fager back to the race lead here. Bab gonna look to the inside, now to the outside. Moyer gonna take that second spot away. Billy Moyer, great restart. Moyer now to the runner-up spot. They're gonna run three wide. Stormy Scott right to the bottom and two. How about Stormy? Great restart for that Rancho Milagro. Two card, three wide for the second spot. Jason Fager continues the lead. Moyer second, Bab third. Moyer Jr. to the outside now with a two of Stormy Scott. Drake Troutman's right there as well. Great battles going on behind your race leader, Jason Fager here. Jason Fager, 2011. Last time you won a hell to a race here in Brownstown. Looking awfully good right now. Next time by, we'll be halfway through. Shannon Babb to the inside. Here comes Billy Moyer Jr. Following his dad around, rolling up top. Billy Moyer to second, Billy Moyer Jr. to third. Shannon Babb and Stormy Scott still the top five outside of the top five. Drake Trotman is sixth. Best battle still out there is that battle between the 21 Jr. and the 18. Billy Moyer Jr. and Shannon Babb still in a dogfight. There goes Babb. I told you there was a couple guys trying to drive it in deep and maybe pull a crossover move. Not really a slide job there, but Babb a crossover to take third back. All right, Billy Moyer, you got anything for him? Here we go. White flag will be in the air this time by Jason Fager. Picks it up with one to go. Fager down the back straight away. Still your race leader. Moyer's not going to have enough, I don't think, to get to him. Into turn three, out of turn four. He led all 50 laps. The high side hustler wins it. Jason Fager gets it done in 25. Hat is on. Who's your neck band is on. Ladies and gentlemen, your Hell Tour winner tonight, the high side hustler, Jason Fager. Uh, it definitely feels good to get the monkey off your back. You know what I mean? We're happy running second and keeping the car in one piece and making some money, but the crew's been on me pretty hard and they bust their butts, so they deserve this. So this one's for them guys. And uh, man, it's just awesome to get the monkey off your back because I've went through this whole deal, not one of these before, and I've went through them and won several. So uh, it just feels good. So now it's like, you put that away and you just focus on racing and not having to worry about catching that first win. But I got to say happy birthday to my mom. I don't know if it's midnight yet, but it's got to be close. But uh, her birthday's tomorrow. So I won her, as my first, Todd Turner was talking to me today, and my first summer national was on her birthday at Granite City. So basically the same day, like in 2009, so a long time ago. So pretty cool uh, to kind of be able to repeat in a different way, but on my mom's birthday. So it's awesome. Man, I just thank everybody that helps me. Uh, Titan Industries, Floyd's Waste the ser Services, uh, Rosser Battery, Digital Copy Systems, Where's Machine, uh, Jay Dickens Motor tonight, Longhorn Chassis running great, uh, Bill Stain Shocks. Uh, just everybody that helps me, I couldn't do it without you guys. RLM, Poker Trucking, uh, VP Race Fuels. So just thanks for everybody that makes it possible. I thank my, my wife and my little one win back at home. So miss you guys and uh, gotta win. Uh, well, the track lined up there, you know, it rubbered, so it's frustrating. I wish we could have put on a better show for the fans, but 
Uh, we're going to take it any way we can get it. But, I, I, you know, being out front when it rubbers like that, I mean, it's stressful at the same time. Like, I was really having problems seeing my signal guy. Like, for whatever reason, I spotted he was standing. My, my roll bar and my A-pillar was just blocking him, so it was hard for me to see him and get in a turn three car just right. But, uh, you know, it worked out. I was... You know, and it just, uh, it's a nice peace of mind knowing you got Billy Moyer and Shannon Babb behind you because you know them guys are going to race you hard but clean. And, uh, you know, I'm sure Billy's happy with second. You know, it's a good run for him and a good run for Shannon. So, uh, you know, been at it for a long time. So it's a good peace of mind, like I said, with knowing them guys behind you and knowing nothing crazy is coming. And, uh, you know, you get in line of that rubber and you just kind of got to follow. And, you know, if a lap car messes up, you can take advantage of it. But, man, it just, everybody has so much traction when it's like that. And it's just, uh, it's really hard to pass. So, uh, but you know, we don't care, $10,000 and we're gonna take it.